Hi everyone, this is Taylor here from Blue Boutique and in this video today I'm going to show you how you can prepare your cats to be car trained. So you might be wondering why you would want to car train your cat and I personally think that this is a fantastic idea to reduce the overall level of stress that your cat will have every time you get your cat into the car and also it's overall less stress and headaches for you as well. So in this video I'm actually going to show you how you can prepare a portable kitty litter for your cat and I will be addressing how to actually use it and train your cat to use it in a second installment of this, uh, of this video log. So that will come out next week. This backpack here has got really sturdy sides and the really great thing is when you open it up, you do have a clip here which does connect to the harness. So um, I will show you further in this video um, how that all works. I will demonstrate by putting that on my cat, but you can see that the harness clip here is a great place um, for you to obviously clip that too. So that is perfect for when you're in the car, you have that option or you also have a pet seat belt, which I'll show you in a moment. But this backpack is great. It has the top flap and it's got the front flap and it's also got pockets, which is really important, especially when you're taking your cat on adventures. All the pocket space you can get to free up your hands will be perfect. The next item you'll need is a harness. Um, my harnesses do come equipped with the D-ring clip, which does connect to the harness clip that I was speak speaking about a moment ago. Um, we have a range of different harnesses available. I use a retractable lead. I get this one for $8 from Kmart, so it's a really cheap one, and it's um, got three meters retractability. Uh, and then finally, this is my pet seat belt that I use. All these items I've shown in a previous blog on, on my website, which is how to prepare your cat for adventures outdoors. So you can check that out on the cat spot on the website. I highly recommend taking treats with you when you're taking your cats for an adventure. I love the raw meow freeze dried kangaroo treats. My cats absolutely go crazy for them. I like to give that to them once I've actually reached the, um, the destination. I use dine treats inside the car because as I'll show you right now, they're in a really nice little packet here, which means that it's really clean and tidy. Um, you can see that Romeo absolutely loves this treat. Um, anytime that it's around, he will come running. So this is the harness on my kitten Anubis. He is six months old and he's wearing an extra small harness. It is still slightly too big for him, but he will grow into it. Most cats grow into an extra small. It's the right size um, for an adult cat, for most adult cats. Um, as you can see here, I've put the clip on him. So he's now attached to the backpack. One of the great ways that you can get your cat into the backpack is by encouraging them by kind of tickling the back of their feet. You can see he thinks he's in the backpack and with a little bit of encouragement, I'm able to get him in there and to zip that up as well. And then I'm just gonna open the top here and show you his cute little head poking out. He thinks he's going on an adventure. He's not quite going on an adventure just yet. And then at that point, I would usually give him a treat. So the next part is how do you get your kitty litter ready for going on adventures? So I purchased this carrier here just from Target, but I know that Kmart and I'm sure Big W would sell them as well. You need one with a nice big large zip that unzips all the way and also has this top flap here as well. The top flap is going to allow your cats to be able to get into the kitty litter when you're in the car or even when you've reached your destination. So you can see my cats, they love all the carriers. They are extremely used to it because they go on adventures. So they know that um, the bags are a safe place. Now I bought a little carry, a little um, basket like this. Again, you can get this basket in Kmart or Big W. Um, it's really cheap. I can't remember how much it was, but I think it was maybe five dollars. And then at this point, I uh, pretty much just take the liner out of my existing kitty litter and I put it into the basket. So you have a few options. You could just put a brand new liner in with some new kitty litter if you wanted to have a dedicated traveling kitty litter. But because I don't take the cats in the car too often, I do prefer to just go for one um, of, the, of the litter trays that are already, um, already set up and ready to go. So I'll put that into my basket and then using the side of the carrier that opens up all the way, I will just simply slide that basket into the carrier and then zip it up. 
and this will basically allow you to take your kitty litter with you really easy and comfortably and as you can see there's a top up there so the cats are able to get into it nicely i did originally look for a portable kitty litter but the one i found on amazon was about 80 dollars all up this little setup cost me about 25 dollars and i obviously have the kitty litter there ready to go so i don't need to waste any litter you can see i've just spilled a whole bunch of litter there whoops um and then you can obviously zip up the top flap there too, so that when you're transporting it to and from the car, you've got an easy way of doing that. Again, it's got a great shoulder strap so that you could put it on your shoulder and free up your hands. So that's it from me today, guys. If you have any questions, please submit them through the Blue Boutique website. That's blueboutique.com.au or through our Facebook and Instagram accounts at blue.eboutique. Have a lovely day.